Hi everyone! If you think this design looks familiar, it's because I decided to do a remake of it. Let me know in the comments if you've seen the original video. It was posted 6 years ago. The old video wasn't even in HD. And since it was such a popular video, I decided to refilm it. So if anyone wants to watch it, they can enjoy a better quality version of it. Hope you enjoy watching. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos. Also, there will be a new giveaway and winner announced for the last giveaway at the end of the video. As always, start with base coat to protect your nails. Then a layer of a grey polish as the base colour. Apply to all of your nails and let it completely dry before moving on. Next we're going to use the Conard M56 image plate with the pretty French tips to create this design. Apply black stamping polish over the swirly design and scrape off excess polish using the scraper. Then transfer the design using the stamper. Check that the image is complete, then aim and roll it onto the tip of your nails. In between stamps, you can clean the image plate, stamper and scraper with nail polish remover. Once the plate and stamper is dry from the remover liquid, repeat steps for the next nail. This French tip design was actually created for short nails. I like to keep my nails short so I can use my hands more efficiently for everyday chores, but I do like the look of long nails. Unfortunately, I only have short nails to work with, but you can still create lots of pretty designs with short nails as well. Once all the nail tips are stamped, we can move on to the next part of the design. On the same image plate, there is a bow tie design in the middle. Apply white stamping polish this time. Scrape off excess polish and pick up the design using the stamper. Again, check that the image is complete and try to place this design in the middle of the two colors, half covering the tip and half covering the gray area. Since the bow design is quite wide, you do have a lot of room for error with this one. Do the same for the remaining nails. Next, use a flat brush soaked in polish remover to clean away any excess prints around the nail. Then one last thing we're going to do. Apply a drop of clear polish as adhesive and place a 2mm rhinestone in the middle of the bow to decorate. Finish with top coat to secure the decals in place. It's such a cute and simple design to recreate and it looks super festive for the holiday season. If you would like to win this image plate and some rhinestones, subscribe to this channel, give this video a thumbs up, share it on Facebook and leave a comment below to enter. If you can remember, let me know how long you've been watching my videos for. If you are new to my channel, welcome and if you are a regular, thank you for your support over the years. Good luck everyone and thank you for watching.